Hi everyone, um, today I'm just going to make a quick video uh, showing you how to merge your tracks in GarageBand. Uh, as you probably know if you use it uh, on the iPad and iOS, um, you only get 8 tracks, uh, which is a bit limiting. Um, what you can do now is um, merge all these tracks uh, all together into one track, uh, freeing up 7 more tracks. and I'm think you can, well I've not tried it but I'm assuming you can do the same on each track till you run out um, so you have 8 tracks on each master track um, anyone who used the uh, the old 4 tracks back in the day, the old Tascams and so forth um, will probably know this trick uh, so what you need to do, you've got all your tracks uh, you've tweaked them to how you think they sound pretty good um, and then you choose one track you tap on it and you get an option to delete or merge sorry my camera's not very good so I can't really get them very close but here it says merge so you, you click on merge and then you get an option to select from down the side so you select all your tracks and over here press merge now the iPad will do its work, it says duplicating songs now merging it's a really cool feature, um, something that was missing ages ago uh, it'd be nice if they put a few more tracks on really, sort of 12 um, but, but this is a good way of working I'm getting there Should have chosen a shorter song, really. There we go, it's normalising, and now it's all in one track here. Let's wait for it to build itself. But basically, everything that was individual tracks uh, are now all merged onto one track. So you can play that. There you go, there's all your tracks on one, now you can add more tracks, and more tracks, and more tracks, and that's basically how you merge all your tracks together to free up more space. Uh, I made this video because I couldn't find anything, um, I hope this helped, uh, please like and subscribe, take care, see you again.